Hey guys, welcome back to the San Juan La Union vlog. Uh, reporting from uh, Ely Norte here, surf report. We got a local rescue going on. We got surf, surf instructor going out there on a green soft top. And about three tourists got drug out. You can see the riptide right here. These people in the, you know, they're, they're in danger of getting drug out too. Oh, there they go. I think they're getting drug out. It looks like he's handling them. Gave them a green board to grip onto. They just, yeah, here goes another guy to go help. I was here another time and there was two guys that got drug out on a riptide and I just like paddled out really quick, gave him my board. The guy was like just ready to go under and another Filipino went out and got the other guy. You gotta be careful if you're visiting here. You're not a strong swimmer and there's some waves. Just like, don't go out past your waist so you don't get drug out, you know. Uh, so he's got another guy out here with a board. As you know, here in the Philippines, there's no lifeguard stands. There is one right here, right here. But you can see there's just a uh, little buoy in it. And the only people that are gonna save you are like this guy right here. He's a local surfer and, and uh, giving a lesson to some uh, vi visiting tourists. But you gotta be careful because there is, I mean, you're at the, you know, the, the whims of somebody to help you. <laughs> so if you're visiting the beach, just a little bit of beach safety. Uh, if you're not a strong swimmer, you know, don't go out past your waist. You can see that you got two uh, two green boards out there now. Two local surf instructors. They're uh, they're going with the current, getting out of the riptide, and then they'll paddle them in. They'll be fine. Uh, you can see like right here where the riptide is. They got a. Uh, they're, they're coming in. Good. And now they're, now they can stand. They're in an area they can at least stand. But yeah, three people got drug out to sea. It's just a good thing, you know, you got some surf instructors here. That's how it works here. If, you, if, you're, not a, if you're not a good swimmer, stay near the surf lessons because they kind of keep an eye on the general public. And uh, it's just, you know, and if you're a, you know, American tourist coming here, you're not a strong swimmer. It's not like they have Baywatch here, you know, Patrick's, what is his name? I don't know, the guy from Knight Rider isn't going to go out there and rescue you as Baywatch. Here's a couple guys on two surfboards, which is cool to see. I thought I'd vlog it just because it's something new. It is the day before Easter, Saturday. And uh, I have another video where uh, Cell and I, we uh, walked down the beach, or I'm sorry, uh, we walked down the beach, but then we walked back on the street in Urbistondo. And I, it's like before it gets dark to show you how, the, how busy it is in uh, downtown Urbistondo. And uh, I'm gonna try to get that up today or tomorrow. I think I'm just gonna throw this one up for today because this is uh, happening right now, Saturday. You can see this area here is not as widely sought after for tourists. This is where I live, right here. You can see like right here, you got Final Option. And you got Awesome Hotel. You got people here enjoying. They are. I thought <laughs> they're being joined with their other friends. They're like, help! This guy here, man, he should get a gold star. He's a good surfer. I've seen him out there at Shotgun and uh, Sunset German. You're the hero for today. <laughs> good job. Ha, ha, ha.
is the other guy. He's the hero for today. I think these guys here, they kind of learned their lesson. They're like, oh my God, I'm so embarrassed. A handsome lifeguard. But anyway, I just uh, vlogged a, uh, believe it or not, a rescue. And that's how it's done here in the Philippines. Surfers are the, are the lifeguards. <laughs> and they're laughing about it now, but they know. They know not to go out. They're sticking close to the shore now. So this is it. Yeah, you can see it's it's good and busy here. You know, for here, this is busy. If you look at my uh, video yesterday, that's Urbistondo Beach. That's uh, further down south. I was going to go down there and go surfing, but, you know, it's, it's just there's a big south wind on it right now. I'm going to wait and see if the uh, if it rains. Now, I'm just going to go back to the apartment and upload this. We do have some swell. It's supposed to be four foot. I would say in Urbistondo, it's probably about chest high, maybe head high, but it's going to be really bumpy. Here's a wave right here. So when it's like waist high here, it's usually double that at the point. It's just like a swell magnet right there at Mona Lisa Point. Take a quick opportunity to say uh, happy Easter week to everyone. And if I don't get around to it, happy Easter. Tomorrow's Easter. Sal and I have just been chilling. Happy Easter to my kids back in the States. And uh, all my friends and workmates and all that, follow me. And to all you subscribers, thank you so much for watching my videos. And, uh, you know, I've seen some great comments. I always try to answer everyone's comment. So if you say Happy Easter, I'm going to say Happy Easter back. Just to let you know. And whenever you ask me a question, I really, I try my best to answer all the questions and comments. So, uh, if you get a moment... Leave a comment. Let me know what you're doing for Easter, where you're at. Uh, what's, what do you do for Easter in the Philippines? Is there a food or something you're supposed to eat? Oh, they got some surfers out now, right there at the uh, Sunset German Brig. It's all closed out, but you know, you could take off, go straight, or maybe get one hit off the lip. This is Mark. The San Juan La Union vlog cell is uh, getting ready to go to Urbistondo, getting all ready. We're gonna go out and see Chloe and Josh tonight at Hiraya. If you guys don't have anything to do tonight, that's where we'll be if you want uh, a really great place to go out and listen to live music. It's, it's, it's in Baknotan, it's, it's out there in the farmland. It's like farm to table. Uh, Ollie and Rochelle run this place. They, they have a really cool, cool restaurant out there in the farmlands. And we're going to go hide out there tonight because most people won't be there. <laughs> I mean, I, artists even go there, but we're going to go hide out there. So if you're in town, we're going to be there around 5. Go out there, you know, support the locals. This is uh, just a local restaurant, really cool. They got our favorite artists here performing live tonight at 5 p.m. Big shout out to Chloe and Josh. They normally play at, uh, Nat, what is it, uh, Bucket Ba, but tonight they're out at Hiraya. Go and support them, stop by, say hi, and uh, happy Easter, everyone. <laughs>